For more videos, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. Make sure to tune in to our next video, DC Machine Design Part 2. Contents 1. Maximum air gap flux density. 2. Output equation of DC machine. I have put the list of machine parameters here before starting our lecture. If you have any doubt regarding parameters you can check it on this page. Maximum air gap flux density BG. It is the ratio of specific magnetic loading to psi. And psi is equal to pole arc by pole pitch. Output equation of DC machine. We know EMF equation of a DC machine is equal to phi Z n by 60 into P by A. Where phi is flux per pole in Weber. Z is the total number of armature conductors. P is the number of poles. A is the number of parallel paths. It is 2 for wave winding. And it is equal to number of poles P for a lap winding. N is the speed of armature in RPM. Then power developed in armature equal to induced EMF into IA. Equal to EPH into I watts. Multiply it with 10 raised to minus 3 to convert it to kilowatt. Put equation number 1 in equation number 2. That gives power developed in armature PA. Equal to phi Z N by 60 into P by A into IA into 10 raised to minus 3. Substitute these two equations below into power equation. One of the equation is equation for specific magnetic loading and other equation says current in each conductor is equal to armature current divided by number of parallel paths. And that changes our equation as below. Then again substitute these two small equations that we already know to our power equation. We know this equation is equation for specific electric loading and we also know speed in RPS is speed in RPM divided by 60. Substituting these two equations in power equation we will get our final equation like this. Put these things together as C0. It is called output coefficient. Then our final power equation that we have to remember will be like this. This is power developed by armature. Don't confuse IT with rated power output P. For DC motor P A equal to P plus friction windage and iron losses. Neglecting losses for large machines we will get it same as P. For DC generator P A equal to P by efficiency mine use friction windage and iron losses. We can neglect losses for large machines.